I'm going to play a game of solitaire to practice decision making for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. If you have a set at home, give this exercise a try. If you don't know how to play yet, check out the link below the video to the lesson playlist. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. Click the bell if you do, that way you won't miss anything. All my tiles are out. They've been mixed and built into walls to the left of these platforms. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game by monitoring the number of tiles left in the wall. I'm going to deal the tiles, 28 to player one, 27 to player two. Everybody has their tiles, so let's look and see what we can do for player one. Okay, for player one, they do have three jokers, which is nice. And I do see a potential pair hand here. One, three, five, five, seven, nine. Anytime I think about playing a pair hand, I wanna make sure I'm not depleting the second hand. So we could potentially play a quint we do have two, six, seven, let's see here, six, seven, eight, nine. There is some potential consecutive run here. Let's see how many tiles we have left over. I try to make decisions so I have eight discards or fewer, nine. So we have six, seven, eight, nine consecutive run, and then the odd pair hand. As an option, we do have seven, eight, nine. I think I would maybe hold little odds. Maybe start by discarding the dragons and then hold these for joker bait. There is some quint potential, but if we were to play a quint, we would have to throw away four pair because we could only use one of these multiples with the wins all right well let's see what happens you don't have to pick a hand until you run out of discards so i think having a plan is good consecutive run odds that's the plan maybe a pair hand let's see what we can do for player two now Okay, look at all those cracks. We do have news. What about if we did a news pair hand right here, seven, eight, nine. Seven, eight, nine, news pair hand. We need a north, a south, seven, nine. That's one option. And then with the leftover tiles, Maybe we could play four, five, six, seven, or six, uh, five, six, seven, eight. Let's just pull off everything but five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. The seven eights are up here. Five, six, <clears throat> or maybe a two, four, six, eight hand. Two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight. Okay, so six discards for this particular decision. News pair hand, two, four, six, eight category. 
Don't have to pick a hand till you run out of discards. Let's see, as an option, maybe keep the five with the green there. Keep that. So I think we could discard those. Let's see what happens. So we're going to go ahead and discard. Let's discard the green. And then we can draw for player two. Five crack. There's a multiple. Anytime you get a multiple, reassess. Now we have consecutive coming in. Five, six, four, five. Here's a five even. Like numbers with fives. Let's discard this one dot. And now we can draw down here. One dot. They could pung it, but I think I'd rather have them play a pair hand. And I don't know if I, I want to take a pung just because I can. We don't have enough tiles to really cinch it. Maybe the one, three, three, five hand using the jokers, but I want those jokers up here, I think. I think I'd rather draw nine crack, nine crack. Okay, let's get rid of the red. And then we can draw for player two, eight bam. We're kind of in between consecutive run and two, four, six, eight. Let's discard the seven dot. Stay flexible. We're gonna draw down here, seven dot, nine crack. Now there's a multiple, six, seven, five, five, six, seven, eight, five through nine, right here, five through nine. Five through nine or six, seven, eight, nine. Let's just get rid of the north. And we can throw that next and draw up here. This is concealed. Four bam. Four, five, six, two, four, six, eight, four, eight, two, four, eight. Okay. Let's discard this nine bam and draw for this player. This is a concealed pair hand. Flower, that's helpful. Let's get rid of that north. And draw for player two. Nine dot, that is not helpful. Let's draw for this player now. Four bam. I don't think that's going to be helpful. One, three, five, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, four, three, one. Let's get rid of this one bam and draw for player two. Two bam. Okay, now, now we have two, six. I think we could maybe give up on the fives. We've got a lot of two, four, six, eight here. Two, four, six, eight, two, four, eight. Um, maybe we could play, let's see, joker bait, fives. Let's get rid of the five dot. We'll just hold that for joker bait and play evens here. Oh, maybe even the two, four, six, eight concealed hand with dragons. We can hold these for a while, but we can get rid of those there. Let's draw down here now. Flower, we don't really need it. Let's hold this three. Maybe we could play three, six, nine with flowers. I guess I should maybe should have kept that red dragon a little longer. Let's get rid of the four bam. We could always use jokers. We're gonna draw up here now. This is a concealed hand, two, four, six, eight. If they had flowers, I might consider playing the first hand with three flowers, but there's a gap there, and I don't want to use my jokers for that. I'd rather play the concealed hand. Six. Here now we could play six, seven, eight versus seven, eight, nine. Let's get rid of this five, bam. 
and draw for player one. Six crack. Okay, five, six, seven, nine. We don't need the twos. Six, seven, eight, nine. Let's go ahead and we can keep the three, three, six, nine. Let's get rid of the two crack and draw up here. Three dot. We can discard that. Drawing for player one. Seven dot. Not helpful, but we can get rid of the two and draw for player two. Two dot. That's a discard. And we can draw for player one. Nine crack. Okay, now we kind of have to decide here. So we have nine cracks, six crack, three crack. Let's count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight towards three, six, nine Kong hand in one suit. That would be the fourth hand down. Two, three, or two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight versus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're kind of in between. Either way, to leverage this pung, I think we could go ahead and give up on these and then hold that as joker bait now. So we're still in between five through nine consecutive run, the very first hand. Uh, we could also play three, six, nine. We would need these jokers with the three. So I think we could go ahead and discard the nine dot and draw for player two. One crack, that's not helpful. We can throw that and draw for player one. Seven crack. All right, now six, seven, eight. I threw away the nine. Six, seven. Let's get rid of the seven dot. That's not gonna be helpful. Okay, we're gonna keep going up here. Six bam. Okay, we need pungs. We could use these in here. Two, four, six, eight dragons. Let's get rid of the red. And draw for player one. Four bam. That can be discarded. And we can draw up here. This is concealed, so we're going to draw. Seven bam. We can discard that. And we'll draw next for player one. We are now going into the third wall, so we're in the middle game now. So each player should know what category they're in. We've got singles and pairs, consecutive run, two, four, six, eight, singles and pairs, news. Here we go. Joker. Okay, we need to figure something out here. So if we play three, six, nine, let's just do three, six, nine, three, six, nine Kongs. That hand is ready on a three crack, six crack, or nine crack, any one of those. Then down here, with the, whatever's left over, maybe seven, eight, nine, and that would leverage three of the four multiples. Seven, eight, nine. Okay, so this would be joker bait. We might even be able to use one of these, some of these down here, depending on how the drawing goes. Let's go ahead and get rid of, let's see. It was one, three, five, five, six. Let's get rid of this five crack and draw for player two. Two crack. So we're playing two, four, six, eight, hand concealed with jokers. The five crack was thrown. Let's discard that. 
that's going to be safe. We're going to draw for player one. Eight crack. Seven, eight. I, w I still want to hold the fives, the three, five, five, seven for that potential pair hand maybe. Let's throw the eight crack and draw for this player up here. We're trying for the pair hand. We've got our pair of eights right there. Three bam, not helpful. Although we can get rid of this five crack. That was a good safe tile. Let's draw for player one. Six bam, that's not helpful. We can draw up here. They already have their pung of six bams. One crack, that's a good discard. Player one. Three crack, nice. So now we could maybe use this down here. So we're, really we, we need, yeah. Oh, what about the 369 Quint? 369 Quint. Okay, so that's a potential there. 369 Quint. Let's go ahead and give up on the 7 Bam. Okay, we got lots of jokers. That's a potential. Let's draw up here. West. Okay, West. We don't need this 3 Bam, so we still don't have to pick. Not yet. Let's draw. 2 Bam. We can discard that. Drawing for player two. Three crack, not helpful, discard. Three crack. This player, I'm gonna quint. Let's go for the quint. Why not with all those jokers? Let's do it. That's actually a mahjong right there. Mahjong on a quint. Let's hold it though and see if we could maybe get a double mahjong. This is pretty far away though. We'll keep a pulse on it. Let's go ahead and discard this five bam though. So we need to keep an eye on declaring this single win, but let's just wait for a little while and we can draw for this player. East. Now they have an east-west. If we had two dots, we could maybe play east and west with twos. There's one two dot out. Let's discard the eight crack and draw for player one. Five dot. Mm. Bummer. Okay, we don't need the six crack. Let's see, one, three, five. That's not, let's see, we have three, four, five, six, seven, and five. Let's throw the six crack. And then we can draw up here, eight dot. Drawing for player one, eight bam. Drawing for player two, one bam. Player one, white. Okay, now we're kind of in between Here's a flower. We have three, seven, three, six. These are paired up. Let's go ahead and discard the white and draw for player two. Seven dot. Player one, seven bam. Player two, one bam. Player one, five bam. Hmm, that pair hand might have come in for them. Player two, no going back now. Three bam. Player one, two dot, not helpful. Up here, two, two dots are out and they have no flowers. Whoops, three dot, we can discard that and draw for player two or player one four dot yeah the three dot was discarded let's throw that and draw for player two 
9 bam, discard, 9 bam. Okay, now down here, we have a quint here. Maybe we can claim that this is still ready on a quint. Let's go ahead and, and claim it, uh, that for a Kong. So I'm just gonna put it back here so you can see a little bit of it right there. We need to Kong here. We need tiles here. Let's throw the four dot and we'll draw up here. Four dot was just thrown and we can draw for player one. Four dot, player two, nine dot, that's a discard. Player one, east, we can throw that. Player two, now up here, east, west, I would not claim it because east and west, there are a couple east and west and north and south type hands. One is with flowers and dragons. One is with east and west with evens and north and south with odds. Because we have no gap of two with the two dots and there are already two out, I would not risk claiming that to try for that particular hand. I would rather continue playing with either the news pair hand the very first one under singles and pairs or the concealed news hand. So I would let that go. Let it go. Five bam, we can discard that and draw for player one south. We can discard the south. Drawing for player two, eight bam. Finally got a keeper there. Let's get rid of that four crack. So they have two discards, three, really three discards for news pair hand and two, four, six, eight concealed. So four crack was thrown. Now we're gonna draw for player one, red. We don't need that. We're gonna draw for player two, white. That's a discard. Player one, six dot. Don't need that. Drawing for player two. Three bam, that's a discard. Drawing for player one. Oh, a dot, oh nice, okay. So now let's discard this one dot. And we can draw for player two. Six dot, that's a good discard. And we are gonna draw for player one. We're heading into the end game now. By the end game, everybody should know what hand they're playing. Here we're playing the consecutive Kong hand, one away. Let's see here. We need a flower in here, two away. And then here we're ready to win on a nine crack for the 369 quint. And then up here, we have three discards for concealed 2468 hand with dragons and news pair hand. So let's draw five crack. That would be a good discard. We're gonna draw for this player here, player two. Oh, south, wow, they needed that. Let's discard the two crack and draw for player one, one crack. We're now gonna draw for player two. Flower, flower. If they end up switching to the news concealed hand, we could leverage these east-west. Let's discard the two crack. That doesn't affect the pair hand at all. And now we can draw for player one. Seven, bam, that's a discard. Player two. Oh, they got a two dot. Oh man, that's painful. Too late now. Drawing for player one. Flower, that is very nice. Okay, looking good. One dot. Drawing for player two. Green, we need just a pair there. Let's discard the green. 
drawing for player one. Oh yeah, that was very badly needed. Okay, although we could play either down here or up here. No Mahjongs have been declared yet. We're in the fourth wall. I think I would wait to declare. Let's get rid of the five dot. I want to see if we can do a double Mahjong. We're going to draw up here. Red, discard. Drawing down here. West, don't need it. Up here, don't need it. Three dot, discard. Drawing for player one. Four dot, we can discard that. Player two. Four crack, yeah, we don't need that. And we're going to draw for player one, six dot. Player two, five dot, discard. Player one, nine dot. We don't need it. We got nine bams back there. We need a seven, eight, nine crack. Or jokers. Here we go. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Here we go. Two, four, six, eight. We're, we're ready to win on a four bam or an eight bam. L how many six cracks are out? One. No nine cracks are out. One six crack is out. Let's throw the six crack. So they're ready. We need to get rid of this. They're, they need a seven crack and a nine crack. We're going to draw down here. Four bam, discard. Now we're gonna draw up here. All right, four bam. We're heading into the middle of the end game. I'm gonna declare Mahjong. You have to really just watch the tiles in the wall. You don't wanna wait too long. I'm gonna declare it. So we have a win here. Two, four, six, eight, and we're going to discard the flower. It's a little risky, this stage of the game, but we're playing a pair hand and I would risk it. We need to get rid of these though. If you have risky tiles, get rid of them as soon as you can. In this case, it's not needed anyway. We're going to draw. We got a south. Now, since they declared a win, I'm going to declare a win to offset that win. So I'm going to go ahead and declare the quint. So now we have a quint against a concealed hand. And at this point, we can discard the south and draw up here. Flower, we don't need it and it was discarded, nobody wanted it. So we're gonna draw here. One dot is a discard. Drawing for this player. Two dot, they would have had it. They would have had it. That's a bummer. Okay, drawing for player one, six dot, discard. Up here, player two, flower, don't need it. Player one, four crack, discard. Player two, seven dot. Player one, uh oh, uh oh, okay. Four crack, don't need it. Drawing for player two, white. Player one, Eight bam. Oh, exchange. Wait, once it's declared, you cannot take jokers. We got to discard it. And we're going to draw for player one north. N E W S east. Drawing for player one joker. Okay, we're going to discard the five dot. They're ready on a seven crack or an eight dot. We're gonna draw up here. 
three bam is a discard just two more picks each three crack that's declared so you can't exchange we're going to discard that three crack and draw for player two one crack discard player one flower OCD discard the two flower player two last pick for player two discard and we're going to draw for player one one bam one bam doesn't really matter we'll discard the joker okay so one hand each we have a 30 point and we have a 45 point so this player would owe this player 15 points this player was one away from ready on a pair hand this player was ready to win but they sacrificed their winning joker for a safe discard instead of throwing the one bam Let me know what you thought about that solitaire game. If that inspires you to learn how to play, let me know. If you already do know how to play, would you have done something differently? Write it in the comment section below. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Be sure to click the bell so you get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or maybe pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Siamese Mahjong using National Mahjong League rules. May all your picks be keepers.